What's up, everybody? Welcome to another University of Hawaii broadcast with our esports program today. I'm Rod, and I'm joined by Mars or Marissa. Hi. Hi. <laughs> uh, so we have a pretty exciting match for you folks against, I believe it's CSUC. Um, not 100% sure on the acronym, but uh, regardless, it's looking to be a good map. I think if I look at the map picks right now, we have Split, Haven, and Bind. A pretty interesting map pool. Um, at least for myself, I know that whenever I play with uh, most of the players I play with, those maps are talked about pretty poorly. Marissa, how do you feel about any one of those maps? I love Split. I know that's a controversial take. You love take. Split. I love Split. I love Split. That's a, that is a hot take. That's a hot take, but I don't know. It's just like, like I feel like, in comparison to a good a good map like Ascent, Split is a very coin flip on how mm. the game will go like once you start snowballing you you'll win the game like i don't know how to explain it just when you get down on split it's hard to recover that's that that's a really hot take um just i mean my hot take i guess would be i really don't like haven i'm like so glad when they announced it was out of the map pool i i hated haven since day one um so i'm you know i'm sure we'll see what happens when we get to there but for now we're into the agent picks we can see that there are pretty pretty standard hovers over here. I mean, the UHE comp, a pretty standard one. The Viper, I've seen it as a hit or miss. It really depends on the uh, ability to alert. But CSUC coming out with the Breach. I, I've seen the Breach run before. I'm actually a huge fan of it. Uh, it just depends on how well practiced and how drilled the team is. What, what, what are your thoughts on the different comps we're seeing, Rosa? I mean, I think it's interesting to go for your main duelist being a jet on this map, just mm -hmm. because there's not as many op angles, and the raise need is just so valuable, and the boom bot to clear everything, and just, I don't oh, know. Oh, well, they, I think oh. they heard you. I, th I think they heard, they heard you. My bad. I Sorry. Think, I think they heard you. I think it's going to be really interesting uh, to see, and actually, I just realized that in, coming in from the UHE side, it's not as common to see both a Cypher and a Viper. So a very defense-sided comp. So it makes me wonder if they're looking to uh, Select your agent. have, you know, just a heavy alert presence on the attack side and just hold it down on the defense. We'll really see. But I really think this is going to come down to a battle of the picks. Because UHG is going to have to play this attack side so slow to get rid of all the util coming in from the defense. There's just so many flashes in this game. I'm so excited. I, oh, you're excited. <laughs> you're excited. I'm so excited. That's a very interesting take. Very interesting take. Reverse it. I only offer the interesting ones. Uh, <laughs> All right, we're going to be loading into the map. Really exciting. Again, again, it's going to be CSUC starting on the defense against UHE's attack side. And uh, I mean, we'll, we'll just have to see loading into the map. I'm very interested to see how they're going to default with the Viper and Cypher. And we're probably going to see the default Viper wall on A. Let's see, that's where Messi is running to. Um, yeah, I, I, I just I haven't really seen this comment. Just super passive. What what is your preferred uh, agent to play on this map, Marissa? Since you you're, you're a split fan. Um, I play Omen. I I'm a terrible Omen player though because I don't use like <laughs> half of his util. I don't TP. <laughs> I don't have anything clever. I'm not smart enough to think of something on the fly. But I love the way like just the controls of his smokes. His blind is that, really easy to hit. That's fair. That's fair. It's really easy to get, you know, value when something big is hurling towards the enemy. Mm -hmm. Oh, we see that the ramp play. We see this one. This is actually one we used in ranked all the time. I guarantee you that Crypto is one that called it. Um, usually we lurk outside B main, but they're doing a slight variation. They come to vents. You see Crypto. Looking, expecting this player, but are they expecting this close and not? Flaws able to get the first pick of the round in this game. You see the Omen holding it down. Jen is able to get one more. Not before Messi with the trade, but it puts UHE in a very unfavorable 2v4 situation. See the UHE players are trying to group up. It's going to be really just a firing range coming down from the heavens. See Yuto coming out. And starting to push out, and there's a lot of angles. UH is gonna have to get a lot of nice picks. That's one coming from Kuri, but I'd really get more. Oh. Stop at two. 
Yeah, pretty. I mean, pretty close, right? Getting two in a two v four, pretty good. Um, Fortunate to be close to deal, but really good discipline from. I'm just gonna say CS. I'm, I don't. I can't say the that whole acronym. It takes a little too long. But really great discipline from CS. Just waiting in all grouping heaven, just to yeah. guarantee. You know, they're not giving away picks. That is that 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 is very disciplined. Really good from them. I mean, it's impressive to see, like especially when you're in a four v two situation get a little greedy right you want to mm -hmm. i want the kills i want the kills but yeah. discipline from them Good. so now we see uhe just grouping outside b main hoping they can get something maybe trying to you were forced by there's half by but see they're just trying to group up they have Cover. been heard you can see some of the defense jeeting over towards B. They're looking to get on the site. Owen being caught with his pants down. Not even reacting to the blind. I guess he assumed that no one would push out that way. It's a little crazy, but one they got super aggressive. You see, speaking of aggressive, this breach play not going to be checking under him. Airlock going down. And almost like a little reverse repeat of last round. We have a 2v4 going the other way, but nothing before it's evened out a little bit by flaws. Really good YouTube. Good lay. One enemy remaining. Last player standing. 1v1. Oh! oh. Curry able to seal the deal with a nice 2k at the very end. Able to close it out. And that's an eco going the way of UHG. Um, when I casted last semester, there were a couple things that me and my co-caster would say about UHG. And it's that we are eco players. Like, I don't know what it is about eco rounds. But when you play against UHG, you've got to be careful against their that, players. That that is true. Well, guys, in the I feel, water here. I feel like you hold because you peek with a pistol, but you like will hold with a rifle, and we just can't hold. You know, mm. so I, I think it's hard. But I I mean I you, you love to see it, um, but you know the, I think the big thing is here making sure that they don't get ecoed back because you know, judging by the pistol round, CS has shown their ability to aim with set pistols. Let's see how they play out this round. Need to check. Almost gotten by the shorty, able to get away, but a little bit dicey there. I really like UHG's use of the trip being put right on the vents, so like okay. they know for sure if they're being flanked. I really, really like that. Also like the spot, of the omen from the site, able to get one. Almost a second. Ibs, pretty good spot to play on Nico. Look at another pick. Yeah, Drizzy able to get another one. Oh. Drizzy able to get a second. There's a lot of damage happening. This supposed eco round for CS. Again, lethal with the pistols. Uh, get one more, not able to connect, but pretty good damage. I mean, that was really good damage. Yeah. Just from Coming a bunch from of CS, classics and a shorty. Yeah, just from the classics. I mean, that, that spot by Gibbs. I'm personally a huge fan. It's not one you'd expect, you know, when you're rushing and pouring into a site. You either catch the person coming out of B main off guard or like you did, you just peek out heaven and nobody's, you know, looking at him first. Especially with, I think, I don't know if it was a self sky blind or if that was a blind from airlock, but either way, it was a good blind. You see Gibbs using a skin after my own heart. I absolutely love this skin. It's so RDS distracting. Bundle. I know, it's, but it's red and pretty, Marissa. It's red and pretty. <laughs> that is your theme, I forget. That is my theme. Red and pretty. My standards are low. Unlike <laughs> this angle by Gibbs, which is being held in a very high location. Not everyone hard checks it. Pretty good to pull it out early and a nice timed smoke. I have to worry a little bit. Ah, the Yuto being used to clear out any close area. Dog being hunted down, but Gibbs still not seen. In a really good position here. I'm catching Crypto off guard. Let's see, I really like the default and how they're kind of playing with their food. I mean, had they hit B just then, it would have been really bad. But now you can see, you know, they're giving time for Shadows. the sky to go back to A. Well, they're really grouping I've up. They're thinking about trial. it. He's coming in and actually it was spotted, but Gibbs still able to get one, TPing away to safety. Now with the blind, it would have swing out. Gibbs, great omen play. 
not was not checked after the sky out. Let's see, didn't didn't look like he full committed. I mean, didn't expect the the angle all the way up top. So really good omen player from Gibbs. Man, I definitely know cycle. Messi is kicking himself <laughs> like right now. Because that is oh, one yeah. of the most irritating ways to die. Oh yeah, yeah. It's it, it's it's the, it looks like he almost like came out and pre-fired, right? The the lower spot, but uh and Gibbs really you know, playing up top. Toxins going up. Sean Wilder, the Smokes player. We see a similar play to the pistol round, UHE. Doing a lot of presence up ramp. Raise nade to hold them off. And really, UHE is just trying to get presence, right? They have both their lurk characters within mid. Remember when you could break the sky what... blinds? Yeah, I think what I'm noticing is because it, 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 it's tough because UH has such a slow comp and CS is really not much in terms of info gathering. And so, oh, well, this doesn't matter if Drizzle's going to do that. See, one of the, oh, an unfortunate push, a little misguided maybe to just push through a smoke. You know, when they're when you know your opponent's on eco but i guess it doesn't matter if you got people like jun cleaning up with the double on top of ramp maybe you'll prefer a third but you no know, crypto's gonna trade but you see that the defenders know where these players are you can trap them in might be able to camera taken out get one you see drizzle in a pretty good spot don't think they know that it came from flower yeah goes unchecked the second one drizzle didn't look like he was necessarily aiming at Curry's head, but gets the headshot regardless. And nice little cheeky spot to secure that round as UHE goes into another buy. And that's the thing we love about Valorant. It's the RNG, you know? It's got a little spicy. Ab absolutely, absolutely. I, I, part of me thinks that it was just maybe like lag and it was like a spectator diff, but that was, that was quite the, the that was quite the shot. That was quite the shot. See that UHE is gathering up for a strong A rush. Not much safer, you so close. Blinded. We'll see how it works. Looking to shoot out the safer cam so they know at least Cypher started here. But oh, CS flaws oh, with their pants down. Weapons gone. Honda not able to connect. I know exactly where you see that running in spot with their knife out. Honda able to get two, <laughs> putting UHE into a 4v2 situation. Excuse me. As they're retaking control around, but Driz, difference maker last round, might be able to get some trades back. They're playing super disciplined. You can tell the UHG don't want to give anything up. I mean, that's the way to. Angle. I don't know. I don't know what you do in this situation in a 2v4. Just gotta get like, hope your. Oh, hope that doesn't happen. I hope that doesn't happen. Yeah, that's that, that's rough. And so now. We see Honda chasing the kill, scoping in. Maybe not, maybe not quite meant for COD. <laughs> That's okay. Oh, able to take the off angle. Gibbs, I really like how Gibbs utilizes their TPs. Like it really, I, I really like the usage. You can tell that you know the experience with the character, knowing where to TP to really catch people off. Really, mm -hmm. uh, really unfortunate shots um, coming through that round. Um, just unfortunate that you know knife out coming out through spawn. I mean, maybe yeah. maybe not being calm that hey this is where the reshot the rocket might could be in spawn you know that's always a very important calm to be throwing out but you know in the heat of the moment when you're getting resulted it's hard to blame somebody yeah Toxins going up. you know those videos where it's like pro teams comms i would love yeah. to see that for collegiate scene like just, just no see no you wouldn't no would. you wouldn't i would no you I wouldn't would. Trust me, if you heard certain comms, you would not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so curious what you guys have to say. I, like, it's it's not good. So funny. You're, you're brave. You're See, CS yes, going in with a result of their own. Not able to connect, but got valuable info. Let's see, able to take a fight. Onda able to get one more through mid. Not quite clearing market. Flying in wait. Ghost knows there's one close in his cage, but couldn't do anything about it. 
UAG is going to get ace eight for free, but it's really going to come down to how it's held in terms of heaven, but fortunately it is not going to be. Drizzle providing CS a lifeline into this round. Pretty hard. Fighting off on the coming in from Sewer. And he's going to have to balance playing his life versus actually putting in pressure. I really like how Messi is playing with him in Viper's pit, though. Yonda doesn't expect one that close. But, whoa! But he yeah, was not expecting the pathing either. And Crypto going down. Messi is looking around, lurking around. Going down with Viper pit. Going down. Onda being a linchpin in this round. Onda not able to connect. Drizzle going absolutely huge for his team to put a fourth on the board. Crazy retake cipher. Crazy retake cipher. Yeah, Drizzle is showing to be. I mean, don't go to the A site. That's that's his domain. <laughs> <laughs> this is a nice spot. I feel like UHG is pacing. Is not too bad. Like they're able to set, like spread the defense pretty well. Yeah, yeah. It's just they're like they're, a little I, I, out of sync almost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Their their macro is pretty solid, but their micro is needs work. Fire in the hole. Like I think their their inter team play feels like, you know, they 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 it, it, they haven't played with each other like enough. Yeah. Yeah, which you see, gives in a very similar spot, shooting from the back, able to still get one. Able to follow up, but you know maybe that's all you need. As it's going to a three v three, flaws able to gain the advantage, but which he have sight, finding the bomb. Us two players have phantoms. Not sure where the player is. And Crypto not connecting his shots. Going into another spot, and again, Drizzle is just going huge. This game, the last two cleanup. Unfortunate, uh, the bullets didn't connect. What do you what, how, what do you feel about these new skins? The, 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 the what is it? The Kuronami? Kuronami that everyone has yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like the pull animation takes so much longer than any other gun. Like I don't know, it doesn't, but it feels like it. Like I no, picked honestly, it up once and yeah, no, I feel the exact same way. The first time I picked it up day one, I like didn't know when I could shoot. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know why it feels like that. We do have a timeout coming in from the UHE attacking side. So you got to see, you know, how they can uh, secure a couple more rounds. I feel like they don't need too, too much with their comp. I feel like defense is going to be, uh, you know, pretty strong for them. But we'll have to see what it comes down to. Because, again, with that breach in the sky and you know, double flashes, you can't kill a raise flying in if you can't see them. This is true. So got to see how that works out. But what 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 do, what do you think of what you've seen so far, bro? So what do you think of the players and players from each team? I mean, I think everyone's playing pretty well. I would like to see more util usage coming out of the hands of UAG. I know that they don't have a lot of attacking util, but I feel like it's just not Thank super you. coordinated. You know? Mm hmm. Maybe you needed some more dry runs in the server. Yeah. Yeah. Because, like, speaking from my experience, like, the Wii teams, we dry run to the death. Like, we run it so many times. <laughs> I mean, that's that's how, though. You, you right? It starts in Valo Plant, then it goes to dry runs. I mean, you, you got to do stuff like that. Because mm. if not, like, you know, against really good competition, it'll show. That's good discipline. Good discipline. Not too much noise coming from UHE as they walk up the ramp. Airlock. With the new skin. And then Gibbs able to take the first pick. So Lurk on B gone. So now it's just all up to these A players. Messi almost getting one through the Viper wall. Now they to connect. So we'll see. We're trying to cook here a little bit. Cam okay, seeing the little toes of Messi there. Airlock getting another one. This so run kind of looking. Not too bright for the white side. Oh, with a, little, a little, a little brighter if if they do that. I, I, I get why what he was trying to do, but uh, it's really unfortunate. Down. 
30 seconds Ooh. left. Gibbs lurking up. They actually have the whole team of UH contained because they're pushing into sight. So they're going to be pretty fast flanking. Crypto has to get one here, and he does, but again, Drizzle. I think one, they're getting traded out. Dropping the bomb, even Crypto one, but does not expect a flank player. I mean, how do you expect somebody that close? Actually, might might be given a lifeline into this round, actually. You can get aggressive. Jun has to know Crypto went elbow. Crypto doesn't know he's holding. Stick it. Doesn't half sit. That's off and it would have read where in crypto went. That was a very nice try though. It was very mm -hmm. close to that. Yeah, that was hard. Just being in one v one, your enemy knows your location. I mean, yeah. The best you can hope for is to win your gunfight, but yeah, it's just. I mean, it, 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 it's a forge. It was close. Can't really do much about it. It's a good play uh, from both sides, and I really, I mean, good discipline coming in from Jun. It was also a good eco round. Like, they were on a save for a light buy. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Let's see how it goes. Now, again, a pretty heavy presence coming in from A. They do have their lurk players. Makes me think if they're going to do something mid, maybe try to take heaven control and go mail or try to converge on something towards the mid side. You see a really good cipher cam because you, you can see it actually gets out. above that viper wall. They found my they found no cage triggered. It's so interesting to see take. the meta evolve. Oh, what's up? What's your hot take? I know this might be controversial, and I'm also very low elo, so maybe my opinion doesn't matter. But <laughs> I don't like this viper wall. Really? Yeah, I'm just not a fan of it. I feel like... I don't know if there's a better one out there, but I feel like this one... I know it's supposed to isolate your gunfights, but I don't know. I just... I think yeah. there's got to be a better wall for it than this one. I don't know. That's my I don't know. I, th I think it's nerve-wracking to know that, like, if you flash through, like, somebody could easily, left. like, not flash and just, like, trade you. And you're going through a Viper wall, so you have instantly less health. Uh, it, 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 I, I think I think it changes the game. It depends how you can play with it too. Um, some people have been playing with the Viper Wall a little bit differently, especially since the Outlaw came out. I know it's banned. But, oh, but you know it's not banned. Now they're getting a double and spawn. Really good at getting aggressive. Messi, nice Molly. Bottom. I'm really low. So UHG has to actually stick this plan. They know where the last person is. They're able to get the plan. On the coming around through heaven for the third. A really nice aggression coming in from on the peak. That's like key to being a good player is knowing when to be aggressive, knowing when to fall back, and just knowing how to play around your util, like the satchels to get in there faster. It's just, I yeah, think Holland yeah, is no. a pretty solid player. Yeah, no, it, it, it's, it's really, really good uh, to know. I think it helps that this team seems to be running through their spawn, like not as ready with the uh, weapons, but that just goes to show, you know, Onda like, knows that timing, right? Like, oh, they don't expect it. Probably UH just probably doesn't expect to push like this either. Full coming through, able to spam one, but he heard a lot of Uto and players are a little low. Messi has to get out of there. You see UH trying to scurry on over to the B site. Reunite with Ghost who hasn't heard anything. Poor Drizzle. I feel like in this Hanging situation away. like Ghost should take more space as they getting full pushed A, you know? Like, I feel like it's yeah, an advantage. I think it's like, hard because if if the wrong player sees him, uh, like, if it like if it's Cypher, then you, like, immediately, it's the high likelihood that Cypher is still on B, you get picked because you don't check a wrong, you check a wrong corner. Uh, it, you know, it's just a gun you don't have. Uh, it can be a little tough. Like, I, I agree, but I think it's tough if you're not, like, at least doubled up. In a tough position. Airlock gonna try to see if he can get his, but not able to. And Crypto puts him down. That's gonna go five in favor of UHE. Seeing if we can't get it even half before switching sides. Actually, see Flaw taking out. a TO, yeah. 
Mm. You can see that maybe flaws, or not even flaws, excuse me, uh, CS, I'm not sure how confident they are in their attacking, or sorry, their, excuse me, their defense side. Mm. Oh, no, it is attacking side. Sorry. I mean, <laughs> color, color, colors are hard, but, you know, just to use both. Sometimes if it was this late in the half, I would typically save both of our TOs for the second half because yeah. you never know what's going to happen, right? Like, at the end of the, by the end of the first half, you kind of get the vibe. Like, okay, they can play aggressively or they play slow. But you never know what they're going to pull out on the other side. So it would be real tough. Yeah, I feel like just calling a timeout now, it's like the, you're going to have to reset everything anyways, so... But, I mean, I, I don't mind. Like, if they're cooking and, you know, some teams actually do have the foresight, right? They are, will start talking about the next half. They'll be like, mm. okay, look, this is what we're going to do. You know, they use 30 seconds. Be like, this is what we're going to do this round. But the next round, I, you know, the IGL will, like, I really want to cook with this strat. I really want to put the enemy team for a loop. So, I don't, I don't mind. Mm. It's, it's, it, it is, you know, it, it's definitely a stylistic choice from either the coach or the IGL. interesting nonetheless can't wait to see can't wait to see what they cooked up this round right to see if they won't go for an aggressive play or just if the team needed to kind of cool down oh yeah maybe after that aggressive play they need to just collect themselves because they are very disciplined yeah. but yeah. it's a little different well, style this wow thing. this this cypher trip is lethal this one coming in <laughs> from drizzle is lethal not able to on the oh it would unable to connect it's hit by the trip, but it doesn't matter. Drizzle not looking at the right spot, but doesn't matter. We're to get the first one. I get traded coming in Curry and Will. You see UH being put in favor, not before it's equalized by flaws. The Vipers pit up. This was Sky is all. I mean, this is the round to throw everything you got. There's just so many flashes. <laughs> Just trying to blind in, yeah. I mean, this is it's tough to play against. And Crypto is, you know, forced off the angle. Now it'll really hold this. Let's see how they try to clear him out. Doesn't fully clear. Crypto able to get the first one. Once that there's a second close. We're going to see how the people in the Viper Pit play. Free, kind of leaving. That would have, would have connect. Player standing. One enemy remaining. Go to trade. Nice. Oh, nice secure from Messi, but really close, really yeah. close coming from CS. You know, that's Switching not exactly uh, what you want to see when you have somebody be main and a couple people inside of the Viper all a little closer uh, than you would have liked. But overall, a, a good half from both sides. You really see uh, the strengths of each team, right? You see individual players get the shine. You see the discipline. Uh, and how drilled CS is as a team, mm -hmm. as well as great individual performances from both Drizzle and On the Peak. Mm -hmm. I mean, a, right there. A cipher that can aim is a scary cipher. That is true. That means that means you're no longer allowed in his sight. That's yeah. And have a, a sight right shut there. down on a two sight map is not great. Mm -hmm. See that. Do have, oh, pretty interesting trip. I was trying to go for the spam. Able to connect a couple bullets, but no kill. See able to finish what Go started. Jen. Oh, we do have a really good lurk from Gibbs here coming through. Main it or sorry, she's from mid. Doesn't look like a lot of the players expected. The bomb on airlock kind of in a precarious situation. We'll see what Gibbs can work with here. I'm just spotting him out. And again, gives it the TPs, keeping them guessing. They're taking some damage and maybe not, might not even be looking at the right direction. Gibbs saw on the drop. They got a little more info. Ghost able to get one. It's in favor of UHE. Onda able to get the timing, but doesn't expect the second. So they trade back a little bit and now have a little bit of chance. UHE looking to just ignore that player. Laws on site. Get caught out by Messi, and now it's all up to Drizzle. Scary Cypher from first half. Let's see what we can get. See if Drizzle is really careless. Eventually has to force the issue, and who are you going to put him down? It got a little bit messy, but I, I like what <laughs> the attackers did. You know, sending the Omen up late. 
Anda saw him by pure chance, right? Because you know he's mm -hmm. jump peeking not to watch the vents. Right? Like he was looking for a ramp and it just happened to see Gibbs there. I feel like what went wrong was they were really taking their time that round. The bomb was not quite on site. Yeah. I feel like because they had so much light control for so long, it made it more obvious that people were lurking. Uh, yeah, no, that's fair. That's fair. No, 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 that's absolutely fair. That's really true. Speaking of lurking, yeah, on the lurking in the smoke with the judge. One of the scariest prospects to have a judge in male, name a more iconic duo. Yeah. <laughs> Good info gathering. We do see one coming in. On the getting a little bit aggressive. He wants to put that judge to use. But he was talking that mid corner. If they can't get a pick. Does he look semi aware? Yeah. Gibbs might creep up. Get a kill with his flash. There are a lot of eyes on mid right now. See. On the little, very interesting peak. On the really going aggressive, getting some feels for free, but up before Messi can secure two more for three in the round. Goes cleaning up. A little bit aggressive coming in from Honda. I don't think you gotta go in quite that aggressive for uh, the sake of a judge. Yeah, really going. Back I like, I like the I enthusiasm, but uh, yeah, maybe maybe a little maybe a little much. Here. Yes, this should do. Wow, this is a nice spot. I love watching the Sentinel set up. I just like seeing, like, I wonder what's going through their heads. Like, ah, oh, yeah, they're gonna, mm. gonna do this and that. See the judges back in on his hands. It was a strong apron. There's so many flashes. Yeah. So many flashes. We're only coming spectating in blind people. <laughs> yeah. That is true. We got on there really close in the smoke. Looking like they might try to peek out if he hears a reload coming in from the raise. But does he know it? Don't matter. Drizzo able to get one. That's ram control for the attackers. We see Crypto kind of cheating over to the B side, which is where the attackers are actually going to be ending up. Smoke to help Ghost on the site, but it's going to be enough. We got four attackers attacking. We do have Ghost. Good for one. Going into the cage. Really smart. He would have get one more. Down. He would have get a third on the round. Two more up. The attackers barely missing each other. Watch from two different angles. Goes with the fourth. Maybe on for the ace. Whoa. And Ghost getting the ace, holding it down. On the site, great play around his own util. A cypher that can aim is a scary cypher. A cypher that can aim is a scary cypher. <laughs> Really unfortunate. Similar to how UHE had a little bit of some disjointed attacks. It looked like that. This goes here. That call was a little bit more on the fly and a little bit, you know, not a, not as practiced. Mm. See, some of the user yes. wasn't there, but that's okay. That goes there. We have an eco run coming in from CS. Come on, it's time to get some eco frags, take some guns out of UH's hands. Blinded. That's about what they're going to do next round. Because again, we see the new gun. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. I just wish it was more red. Here. Mm. Yeah, I just, I mean, a pretty, pr pr pretty standard Here. ask for me. <laughs> I was actually talking to a Riot dev uh, earlier last week, and I was like, hey, man, I know you don't work in the skins, but like, can you just make them red? Like, can you just, <laughs> please? Like, I don't know how much power you have, but like, can you? That's so funny. <laughs> I like, like I asked him. I was like, "Why doesn't the Kudo Yami bundle like more red?" Like I just, like it was, it's nice. But, like, I don't know. Like, you made a water ninja. Make a fire ninja next, you know? Mm. That's okay. That's okay. I can, I can hope, and I can only uh, put little sweet whispers into it uh, every so often. One enemy remaining. See, so, yeah. see us being cleaned up. Be. Flawless can do anything. Not able to get anything. This is gonna be a flawless coming into the UH. Grenade! Going to from We're gonna see what CS can bring Super to the table. To I really want to see a like a just like a really coordinated sight hit. Like I want to see a sight hit from CS that looks like they talked it over in Valo Plant. 
mm. where it's like I'm flashing here at three seconds, at six seconds, you're sending like sky guiding light here. Uh, yeah, I, like that's what I really want to see because if they could get a lot of those down, like playing against a breach on this map is lethal if you know how to coordinate those timings. Mm -hmm. You see maybe one of those plays coming in on the A side of the map. George playing completely off of it. Full retake because they thought it was going to be a fight for B main. Not a single soul there. You see Drizzle uh, taking some control. Gibbs with, again, the best skin. Kind of skin in the game. This with the Zed. Anything that moves and has pretty colors. Very interesting smoke. You can see the idea is to kind of split into mid and maybe join Drizzle. Get on the beat off guard. On the beat. I mean, good. Oh, Messi's time even greater. I'm gonna get three, and now it's gonna put CS in the disadvantage. See flaws on five health, so there's a maybe to look bait for him. Oh man, imagine if flaws didn't run away. This could have been a dog kill. <laughs> they found my wire. And you can see because of how goes Uto acted, Here. I think. He was on his way out, and they actually got left. Kuti to rotate over, but what do they know? Went back to the A site, and Crypto, the only person here, actually gives CS a pretty good chance into the round. And Crypto, being aware of the angle he's holding, able to hear the drop. So nice point to his teammates that he knows. That will connect the shots, though. One enemy remaining. What a fight for him. Spike down Oz, A. Not holding the bomb, and now Drizzle has to peek, but Crypto holding it down. Well done. And really, I mean, that's just a tough situation for CS, right? Like, it's kind of hard to justify sticking the plant there and just trusting your teammate when you don't know if they're coming from heaven. You just kind of kind of yes. push the person that you know is there. Uh -huh. It's a pretty, pretty tough scenario. Here. Hmm. You can see that... CS seems to really favor the A side. Oh, we have party chat. Friendly banter, I, I hope. It's definitely just an accident, but you know, a man can dream. <laughs> see Drizzle coming in. I'm with the sheriff, seeing if he can do anything. Not able to. Actually, I actually had faith. I really thought Drizzle was going to get like two there. <laughs> I just, I just had the feeling. He's the player to do so. He's the player to do so. And Gibbs is the player to find a really... Good timing on his ult. You can see that East, or A side, excuse me, belongs to the attackers and flaws. Would it get the kill onto Ghost? I have to see. Do they hear them running and spawn? And they do. And it's going to be quite a hard retake for UH. Both the Rays and Omen pushed all the way up. Just holding with a specter. Looks like he's gonna drop. Oh, but it's some rope so tech. Aware. So aware. Messi! Down, kill on the ramp, it actually equalizes. One enemy remaining. 30 I'm seconds looking left. for the player on the side. No one's here there. Does the guesstimation and hits the rocket. Good retake from UH. Good timing for Messi coming in from the sewer just to be able to kill the bomb bunner. Uh-huh. Really a, a fortunate timing. I really thought that CS, I mean, they had really good positions, but, you know, just the small plays of, you know, on the doing the rope peak and Can I get a drop? You know, them Thanks. trying to plant for heaven. Like, as soon as they were, like, heaven players die. It, it, it's just kind of unfortunate situation after unfortunate situation over time. Has been. Lineup like that. Anytime I see a lineup, huge fan. <laughs> Grenade. Some people, some people don't know, but they're they're, they're small lineups that that will make or break around. I agree with that. I like. I remember. I think it was a chance, and it doesn't really matter because they won anyway. But I think it was EG Demon One was playing uh, Brimstone on Fracture, and had he had a lineup. From like heaven to like a site for post plant, he would have won the round. Spike down 
round B. You do know is that a lot of the trades going in favor of UH. Damn. I say that, but Jun just puts on the peak down. Just one shot is all it takes. I actually had the Guardian last round too and looked pretty lethal with it. Was able to get in crypto. You can see the UH has opted to play super off site. Probably in the interest of Jun having the showstopper. Yeah. There it is, and they would expect left. the showstopper being used early to clear space. And you can't really do anything about it, right? You got to kind of use it that early mm -hmm. clear space because you're just in such a disadvantage. Mm -hmm. Right, going mm -hmm. down, Jin being on Overwatch. Off your feet! One enemy remaining. See what they can cook here. Airlock able to cook a little bit, but could he able to get three in the round? And that's going to be first map in the favor of UHE. So what do what do you think of what we saw? I'm actually really impressed with you. Like, not that they're not. <laughs> that is not good. Not <laughs> that okay. that sounds so that, bad. That came off kind of rude, but it wasn't intended to be rude. <laughs> that sounds so I'm, bad. I'm like, ready. wow, they played good. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's messed up. They did. They played really good. Like, they really pulled it together in the second half. So I'm impressed. Like. I was a little worried. First half, not gonna lie, kind of looked a little rough, but they pulled it together in the second half. Didn't drop like I don't think they dropped a single round. So yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, I, I honestly, I think uh, good stuff coming in from both sides, right? CS, I mean, you have strong individual performances, and I think both sides had really good macro plays. Mm. You know, right? Like they were good at kind of making the opponent do what or the you know the IGO was good at manipulating the other team right it's like mm -hmm. hey i want these players to move to this side so we can hit a uh and i think both sides were pretty good at it and i think both sides needs to work on micro maybe because they're you know just it came down to the micro plays i felt yeah and it was more just like hey you know one person just played this corner right mm -hmm. like was it like flower box or ghost holding it down on b side around the pillar like it was just came down to the real small stuff i think mm -hmm. i agree yeah, but that's enough about split your favorite map or the map you actually is it your favorite map? Uh, I like Icebox the best. I think your You're face brave. tells me. You're Wait, are your you face... are you a jet player? What? Well, no, I like uh, it, but because I have lineups, I have Viper lineups, so I I like Icebox. That's the only that's the only reason I like it. I like the bad maps. It's so I... fun. Because <laughs> like if I. I like I have a Molly from A site to B site on the fence. Like if they're attacking the other side, like I have a Molly for that. Like I and I have a Viper Orb lineup for that too. Just so that's to so read terrible. The <laughs> that's so terrible. Yeah, I mean that's a lot of people tell me, but I'm proud. Okay. But that's okay. We're going into the next map, which is gonna be Haven. Uh I, I already kind of expressed my distaste for it. Marissa, how do you feel? How do you feel about him? I don't get why so many people don't like it. I'm going to be honest. I feel like it's fine. I don't know. I didn't think there was anything wrong with it, but maybe I'm not seeing something. Maybe you can enlighten me. I, I think just for me, when I had to IGL it, I think it was just really tough mm. because like there are so many different corners you can play in all three sites. It, it, it just made life more difficult than I would have cared for. Mm. Yeah, that, that's, you know, it, it is what it is. I just say it. it Sometimes it's just a just paradise, right? There it can be on like the top of C box or on any one of the boxes on A or just it introduces a lot of verticality. I'm just not as comfortable with. Mm. It was never for me. Do you see some see. interesting comps coming in? The Viper on Haven, you know, got a little popular more recently, the past couple months. I know we saw it a little bit in some of the last Masters and uh, Champions events in the VCT circuit last year. So pretty interesting because i haven't really seen a lot of the viper on this map so you know i want to see how that plays out i got really excited because i saw drizzle hovering phoenix <sighs> and i was really hoping to <laughs> just lock that in i was really hoping that we could lock that in because with their you know with how they aimed so and how they held on sites last game i mean you know who knows maybe we got a little three bomb but oh good showing some flexibility from the players they're changing up some of the roles and we see the Rays go to Omen. Cypher going to Sova. Actually, yeah, almost everyone except Airlock changed roles completely, which is very interesting. Uh, 
Uh, I can't wait to see how that plays out. But again, a breach on this map, which is super good. I think breach on this map is really, really good. It just it's so hard to play around if the breach you're going up against like knows what they're doing. Mm. I've actually had a long going back to the Viper. I've had long discussions with this of our city team about the Viper on Haven. Like they they all are 100% for it, but I'm still a little iffy. Not that I don't think Viper's not good, but I feel like it's hard to Is that a lineup? Oh my gosh, is that a Viper lineup? Is Please that a tell, lineup? Me that was. tell me that was. Where did it land? Oh, oh my gosh. You can't just wait, throw, you can't walk wait. on the site and throw Messi them. is my Messi. goat. No, Messi <laughs> is my goat. I love that guy. That's my new favorite person. You can't just walk onto the site and throw that. You need a lineup. No, no, because look, you have to go all the way to see. That's it's oh it's it's a thing. The, I know I've heard those those kinds of lineups actually like can make or break a setup. That actually like, cracks me on up. On Bind. That's yeah, so funny. yeah, I Messi is my goat. <laughs> I love it. I absolutely love it. Yeah, pretty interesting wall coming in from the Viper. I want to see how this plays, but really fast garage hit coming in. Also able to hold one off. Let me do more. The attackers kind of slow it down a little bit. Also able to get another one. Messi able to get the trade. Now just one on sight. And push. Messi really good with that frenzy. We have Gibbs all alone, seeing what they can cook up here. Looks like the attackers aren't too aware just yet. Where could be actually? Well, I say that, but now they're covering his every entrance. So, Let's see, Curry. So Gibbs really wants that kill. Yep, <laughs> nice and clean. Shots is all it takes. Onda really excited, made steps and realizes, okay, I can't do that anymore. Y'all just group up. All looking at him, Messi really wants him. They swing out as soon as Encrypto gets contact. Doesn't matter because the Onda Peak is there to secure the kill. First pistol round. Well done. One to Uichi. Keep your focus. You want a pistol round? Again, like, I'm glad you're positive, but also this is like the fact that we're cheering about that, like, it worries me. <laughs> Like positivity, <laughs> yeah, but also like, what are you expecting? I feel like pistol rounds are just—I don't know, like I hard on high ping. Swinger gets swung and people are just. That, that's fair. I don't. Know. I I love I pistol plays. Like I'm a I'm a ghost god, but as soon as you put an automatic gun in my hand, like it's over. Yeah. It's bad. Oh, I'm able to get a tag. To Gibbs, Gibbs trying to get away and actually does. He hopping out of there like a madman. Oh my god, Gibbs is so brave. <laughs> wow. Gibbs is brave and has movement to back it up. I love it. We see CS coming and teeing up a hit on this B site. That smoked off, so might need to delay it a little bit more. And yeah, you can see they are. They smoke convinced them. Okay, they kind of expect us here. Maybe let's go to the A site. Site line is being held by Cody. Cody got a little bit aggressive maybe not fully aware they're gonna run into a whole bunch of players they're having to run back oh, maybe wow. hit by the stun but oh. oh my goodness oh but a flash is coming in Ray Uto from airlock on to coming in missing the shots but that's okay ghost is there a viper or almost working against the yeah. team there's definitely a world where Jun hits that right click and gets on the down Good anti-eco from UH, but, uh, you know, a little dicey, right? We're, see we're seeing the power of the breach util, right? That stun, Kuti is forced off certain angles, flashed in, so Jet can dash and try to get those picks. It might have just been an eco round for CS, but we're kind of getting a glimpse into what they're going to be bringing to us for the rest of this half. All the way super aggressive. Almost got timing, but running away. It didn't drop the Spectre for Encrypto. All good though. Gonna retrieve it. <laughs> All good though. All good though. Just just his feelings. Could he not able to be checked? 
See, all the players are out by the grass. On the peak, not expecting flaws. That pushed up. Would have equalized. Now it looks like it's going to be a repeat of last round. Gibbs front of B site. Got to hear that alarm bot. Knowing they can't push just yet. Ghost with a ghost. Looking to try to hold down this site. At least play off it. Oh, and I'll actually get the pick on flaws. Oh. Equalize. Crypto Brave peak. It would have been traded by Messi, but Airlock with the util. Will turn. Airlock with the flashes. Gray oh. util. A little bit messy. A little bit. Honestly, there was definitely a world I'm where Airlock gets like double dinged on accident. Mm -hmm. But it's okay. Showing again, Airlock. I'm really liking their breach on this map. Yeah, it's I don't know. At, at least to me, I don't know if it's a comfortability thing, but they look way more comfortable playing breach on this map than split. Mm. I agree, actually. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I don't know if it's just like the play style or you know what, maybe off game. But Airlock's breach looks really lethal. This map right now. Speaking of lethal, we have on the peak on this angle. If somebody can be brave enough, Surfer's gonna throw out a cam, but it's not gonna see the jet angle. Safe for drone on the game, pretty angry, pretty excited to see what he can spot and will give his position away. You're not exercising the most patience, but that's okay. No duelist player usually does. <laughs> like, I think Onda is one of the most. I don't know how to explain it. He's, aggressive players? He's one of the more aggressive players. Yeah. He does not oh, like holding angles. He's jumping around absolutely. all the time. Absolutely. I I remember when we he first started playing uh for UH on the J V team. Yeah. The amount of times he went too aggressive, I had, I remember yelling at him. So I mean <laughs> I think he's you know, tempered it, which is just made him a better player, which I'm really proud of. Mm. Definitely when I play with him, he's like he does not, some silly he's not things. Not controlled. <laughs> yeah, he's <does> pretty <laughs> silly things. We see yeah. late hit onto the B side. On able to get one. Oh, oh but traded out by Drizzle. Working up to the smoke. Even though with CS at a disadvantage. Pretty good agents. Really good awareness from Cody to dog this out. Okay. Rizzo able to equalize it. He's not aware of that angle. So blind. Two v two. Ghost. The ghost a little. Ghost a little too blind. Pretty able to get the pick. One health. Airlock is gonna secure it with the headshot. Nine health is all he needs to equalize it for CS. And again, it's just the util from this breach. Like I just, I'm a big fan. Mm. How long is a breach blind last? Too flat, too too long, too long. Too long. Long enough, long enough to be scared, not know what you're doing, get blinded again, and then be sad as you get headshot. Oh, good, good to know. Very sad. Yeah, I just, it is. It, it depends on the server that it's being played on, but at least for us in Hawaii, it's. It makes it can be really hard to turn. Yeah. No, I. I can't turn any flashes, but like sometimes, like it's a weird thing where, like, on ping, where you, like you wouldn't think it matters, but it's a small thing where, like, if you do turn it, like it's, it, it just kind of gets a little funky, gets a little weird. We see a time up pretty early in the half coming in from the side of CS, but I don't hate it. You know, it looks like they've kind of gotten a grip on this half, and now it's just a time to discuss any tweaks or changes UH might make. Uh mm huh. -hmm. To see where they go from here. Nice spectator cam. Thank you for taking us on a tour of Haven. Wow, look at that. Wow. <laughs> hey, thanks, spectator. <laughs> wow, so pretty. Look, 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 look at that. Look, look at that. Look at that flat fire. I think that was 2D <laughs> as 2D as you could get. <laughs> uh, really interesting wall from Messi. I, I kind of like how it does split up. Kind of makes it a little harder to take garage. So a site gives them more room to play. On the able to get the orb long. Get jet knives up and running. See how they go from here. 
Look, getting a little aggressive, not knowing that he's gonna run into five. I think Gibbs really might have big. seen him. I don't think so. Yeah, Gibbs able to get one before it I know exactly it out. where you are. And now I mean the jig is up, right? You got they they know they're getting that site for free. Crypto would need to land the most miracle lucky buy a lottery card right now shot. Spike planted. Well, that that, I like that, that trip. second trip is lethal. I know that I trip like that. is I like it's that actually, trip though. No, that is a back. lethal trip. So many blinds. And they don't know about the other trip. Wow. Good cleanup. And of course, shout out to Airlock Juto. Getting a cone kill. A, a nice try from UH. You know, a, a nice try to flood out. But, I mean, really good on Gibbs. Who expects another tripwire in the same spot that... Yeah, you broke the just... first one, right? Like if you didn't hear it placed down, it's kind of hard to expect, right? Because you know that con came in of broke trip close right, and I mean, there's not much to do. Just just kind of an unfortunate situation. Yeah. You're gonna watch this back and be like, he double tripped it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's, there's, there's, there's like oh. The kind of things that Valorant players definitely get mad at. All coming in, able to get a tag and the finish onto Ghost. Spike oh. down. Oh. On peak, not as aware as I would have liked, but that's okay. Might have got heard. Updrafting the trip. That and Crypto looking to see what he can get. He can get the head of flaws. No doubt. Disadvantageous position. You see, investing the sky. Oh, into this round. And two into the back site. Be able to get the trade. Not able to land the shots. And maybe a miracle clutch, but definitely not as Drizzle puts him down. Unfortunate, but good stuff coming in from CS. Mm -hmm. I mean, just the UH players just seem to go down in two different spots and instantly just. You know, capitalize, excuse me, on the situation. It's Sunday. English isn't right, quite coming to me as fast as it could, as it should today. Relatable. Um, yep. No thoughts in my head. Just Valorant. No thoughts, head empty, only Valorant. Mm -hmm. Which is arguably sad, but that's okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can say that. I'm a farming simulator player now. Yeah, hit about to come in on the seaside. Bye, Messi. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's bad. It's bad. It's bad. Oh, maybe oh not. wait, Messi. Maybe not. Maybe not. Staying, staying their life. Staying alive. You're showing the real value of this wall, right? All going down. You can see. Oh, Messi able to get another one. Oh, he sees the last one out. Wow. 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 And we see the value of that wall. Versa, I think Viper on this map might be good. I think I know, I know why they're oh, so good. I had you. Yeah, I just. I'm sorry to take their side, but oh, I believe a pause is gonna just yes. be in the. Uh... Someone paused it. Yeah. Okay, is able to. Uh... Unfortunate. Paused. Unfortunate to stop the uh, momentum coming in from UH, but a great opportunity from CS, right? They're able to talk about what happened. Because it's kind of hard to talk about, you know, when something goes that wrong in a site take. So a really good opportunity for them. Uh, just I thought to you're be not really, supposed hey. to talk during a tech pause. I don't, I don't remember. I rules. mean, you're not supposed to move either. Yeah, there are rules. Are there? I think so. This is like a legit tournament. This is Seabell. You're gonna be like, what the heck? Oh, guys? this is Seabell. Yeah, oh, they're my gonna bad. be like, what the heck, guys? <laughs> what are you doing? Okay. For integrity purposes, CS is not doing that. Because <laughs> they wouldn't do that. But they theoretically, if a team that. were to do that, theoretically, if a team were to do that, this is a good opportunity to figure out what happened on that side thing. Theoretically. Yeah. Not saying you should, but if you were to. That's what you could use it for. Yeah. Oh, someone else disconnected. Oh, looks like somebody else is. Who is that? Airlock, your breach. Your boy. Airlock. Oh, no. Oh no, I'm gonna get his autograph later. <laughs> I'm actually just a fan of his Uto. Yeah. Get his autograph. Just a fan. 
and in the meantime, I mean, really, what what what, what have uh, what have been seeing that works really good from both sides? You know, what are you, what, what are you what are you fans of uh, seeing from both sides so far in this map, Marissa? Honestly, the push up A has been really valuable to get information mm -hmm. and just like you know take space. And then I think what's good about UH is they know when to fall back a little bit when they pushed up A. Like I'm thinking mm. about the one Kudi play where. He's getting breach, stunned, and flashed and stuff, and he just falls back. Just, I can't do that by myself. So, I, <laughs> yeah, good, good, good awareness. You know, you, yeah. you, you, you can be him and know when not to be him. You know, just definitely a good balance to strike. Yeah. Fortunate. You know, I'm just saying, Haven is a bad map. This, this never would have happened if uh, on any other map. These they don't crash if if this is uh <laughs> this is breeze or something like that. <laughs> they don't crash. If it's a breeze. If this is on breeze. That's yeah. I remember there was a uh, one. There was one match. It was on Icebox. Oh, did Airlock reconnect? I believe I so. I'm, I'm We're just watching. Yeah, there's a one, there was one time on Icebox where one Vandal skin. It was the orange Prime Vandal skin. Any time it was dropped on the ground in the server, I would crash. Like that is if we killed terrible... the enemy, like the enemy team was running the skin. So if we killed that person with the vandal, they crap. I like I crashed. That is so weird. It was really bad, and you you can't ask somebody to not use their yeah, skin, like, right? Can you so use just... a different gun for now? Because I crashed like five times that that Here. like that game. It was really bad. It's not really bad. Is this push coming in Ooh, from the side of CS? Flaws able to get the first one. Using the knives to secure that first pick and getting the all of A site. What are the attackers? See a killjoy. Um, not expecting Flaws to be pushed up and updrafted. Good play it now. Flaws probably just gonna. Ooh, oh! Damn. I was gonna stay, stay in that corner and be a thorn in UH aside, but I guess not. Oh, that omen smoke. Just blocking off Gibbs. See you. Oh. Ghost? Ghost? Oh, oh, oh. oh, and on the peak, I guess disconnected. It's fine. I saw on the peak just reconnected, so on you know, the peak is gonna have to work some magic now. Oh, all right, no magic will not be happening. This don't speak too soon. Never mind. Think, it's too late. Maybe we just gotta pad the stats. Oh, and I try. This is just, I mean, pretty unfortunate, but oh wow, wow, that was close, but. I mean, regardless, just a, a good take and a really good place from Flaws. You know, getting aggressive and updrafting up into heaven. Mm -hmm. That's that's duelist value right there. That yeah. maybe see. Yeah, every uh, all ten players are moving. So this round we have everybody. No more after effects of disconnecting. I remember when Harbor ult was breaking the game. Remember that? You'd ult in Harbor and everyone would just lose all their frame. Honestly, I did. There, I've, been, I've played this game since the beginning. Like I just, I've seen. Oh, I've seen so many things. Just like Wanda saw that tripwire last minute. Now the attack is trying to re-clear their flank. Wanda, maybe not expecting two to be looking at him. Definitely not. I didn't expect Ghost, the second one. Oh, nice fake. But now, is Ghost going to push up? Probably will once their Aether gets contact. Maybe now. But great reach flash. See, I mean, oh, hurry. I was going to say nothing you could do, but actually able to get one. Maybe another. I'm going to hold it down on the site. Messi getting two. One with the Molly, and now they know where the last one is. Hell. Saying, hey, chill, 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 chill. Wait, wait, wait. Crypto. Not caring enough. <laughs> Ducking down with the Guardian. Done. And, I mean, good stuff from Kudi. I, I did not expect them to get two there. Really thought that was going to be a clean side take from CS, but, you know, just good plays all around. Not really sure where Messi got the Molly kill, but works either way. You know, at, at, at any point, you know, you, you see that highlight in the top right of the kill feed. You're, you're not saying anything. You're just happy. Yeah. I love you, Tokels. I know, that's why I do lineups. I feel the same way. Can we oh. normalize respecting lineups. Oh! No, we cannot. With the shot hit. Oh, okay. It was worth a try. 
<laughs> Under getting really aggressive. Under. Damn. Oh. Maybe it's again. Barely missing out on that shot. Yeah, maybe a B rush or pushing into the garage area. Look at the A push. So much space. Is so good. So much space. So much info, really. Love what we are seeing from that. Most holding the angle. I want to get one. Wow. Great timing. Flux looking to get a off angle. If Ghost were to jump out, you don't really expect the jet here. Is there a way to get one more? Oh, oh, uh -oh, oh, uh -oh, oh, 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 see? Flaw is so smart. You just don't. <laughs> who expects that angle? Who expects it? Nobody. If you expect that angle, like you're just you're, you're just the best player. Those are the last one alive. Long, not able to connect the shot. Going to be 5-5. Five, five, even across the board. I don't op, so I don't know, but does it like hurt your ego to miss two op shots in a row? Does it affect yes. you? Yes, okay. yes. First one, the first one, you're like, okay, like, <laughs> it is what it is. The second one you miss, you start being like, oh, like, I might not be able to use this gun. Like, 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 like that's when you start coming to your team, like, hey, guys, um, I don't think this is the day. <laughs> Like, I tried and it was mid. Okay, though, we recover. We take those, we recover. Not even worried about it. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> <laughs> a good Viper spit coming in from the side of the defense. Let us see what they are cooking. Oh. Unlucky. Wait, I kind of like this pit. I really like this pit. Messi able to get one. It's gonna I know go down. Exactly. The attack has all of the A site. Cover going out. Under peak has disconnected again. Under peak has oh, reconnected. and reconnected instantly. All right. Oh. We are just on the peak. Just we 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 don't know what we want to do today. We don't That's know what kind of day it's gonna be. Steve is up. I don't know if the enemy team is going to let him get away. But these, these are the moments usually you, you chase him down with everything you got. You really don't want him to save anything. And sure enough, I mean, if he saves it, really, that's 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 a win in itself. But CS is looking to count. Oh, Ooh, one shot. Oh, looking real today. close. And Last it's just not connecting. I don't... See that? Those are the moments y y you just say like, "All right, if I if we pick up an op, I'm passing it off." Mm. I mean, that's like an individual mental thing, right? Like, if you're not if your duelist is not hitting their off shots, it's got to be like, "Well, what am I doing? How do I help the team if not this?" No. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Damn. Oh, able to get the first pick. Not able to land a second. All good though. Oh, on the hitting the shot. Blinded. Very nice TPs coming out. From the crypto, maybe to throw the hackers off guard. I see that, but it doesn't matter. If Flaw is gonna put him down. Spike planted. 
Ooh, I can walk for retake. Last player standing. Bring it down. That's gonna be the first half in favor of Switching sides. Still pretty even, you know, like we saw both maps, but now the second half is where we kind of changes the game. Let's see what both sides are cooking. I'm really interested to see how the Viper is going to work on this side. I mean, you can kind of see it's a pretty interesting wall to cut off info on the a cross constantly as well as just be one less thing that the woman has to smoke when they're hitting b i'm actually a pretty big fan of this wall this is the wall that started that conversation because i was like i don't know if this <laughs> it's pretty it's pretty good as an omen player i'm a big fan like if i can start smoking c like top c as default mm. and you know then if we do like a late b hit i don't have to worry about like hey that's open you know like you can get shot from this it's just it's to me personally, huge fan. Oh no. Oh. Hello. Oh, no. Put it on the peak down. Oh. Just trying to make it back. Oh, the really interesting flooding coming in. Spike down B. Oh. Now it's even. Gives and flaws up. One enemy remaining. Put the oh, offensive in place. Messi with the lay lurk and Oh, it is an advantage for UH. You gotta see what they make of this advantage that they've created for themselves, though. Oh. But they have no idea. Cover going out. They have no idea. This could be an insane play. Oh, Gibbs. Oh, Gibbs, I don't show. Oh, no. Oh no, and you know it's unfortunate because in crypto just it was like a timing of crouching. It was just it was just unfortunate. I know. I don't even really blame Gibbs for that. That is just unfortunate. It's okay though. That's that that's one of the situations where you kinda just gotta shake it off and be like, ah yeah, Auntie. Ah, uh, good job, friend. Yeah, Auntie, uh what 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 happened? I didn't see anything. Did you see anything? I didn't see anything. I can't really do anything more than that. I'd drive you crazy otherwise. All good though. We head into another anti eco round for UH. See us looking to see what they could do. Flaws. Also back here with the sheriff. Gonna have to get a couple. Some players right outside the doorstep. Would you be able to sniff them out? Would you take usage? Oh, but it don't matter. Lodge hits the shot anyway. He hits those. Spike planted. See what else he can hit as you see now the defense is starting to group up. Again, really big fan how they do this. You, know, you don't want to give away any picks too early. Which is the best chance. This push. Oh, I was going to say this push into garage is going to be really good, but if we trade it out, I see he has to speed up. And actually, this is the last one alive. I'm not expecting the omen close. Because we get the first. Not able to connect. And it's going to be a thrifty round. Who decided to see yes? Really interesting because that first play, I really thought they were, that first play was going to kind of catch them off guard. Uh -huh. But you know, I guess they, you know, they recover. No one really expects to push into garage and just get shorted in the face. Very unfortunate. Take so. Yeah. It's okay. CS will take those. I think it was my goat airlock that got that kill. <laughs> it was your goat. <laughs> yep. Let's see what they can do for me. Shadows traveling. Round coming in. Spike down A. Pinged, but pinged a little bit too late. Able to get the trade though, so better than nothing. 
Oh, Laws. Getting one of the pick onto Ghost. Let the defenders are holding true. Oh, we have an Odin in play. I did. I missed that. Huge fan. Marissa, how do you feel? How do you feel about the Odin? What are, what are your thoughts on Odin? <sighs> um, stinky, stinky gun. Stinky, 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 stinky gun. I love. Oh wow! That's your goat. <laughs> Airlock. Yeah, that's my goat. <laughs> Airlock with three, holding it down. Not even using much Uto, only a flash use, so. Good hold. It was an eco round, so, you know, not a huge deal in the eyes of UH, but. So, yes, look into the oh, goal. Wait, oh, that's, oh, that's cute. That was so cute. That's cute. <laughs> <laughs> I had never seen that one before. Was... I've seen people kind of like do like a little, like, like travel, like walk around, you know, maybe a gun or something, a certain yeah. skin, but I've never seen a, a, a calm, hey, one, two, three, chest bump. That was so cute. <laughs> I love that. See a great attack. Oh, 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 do we see Crypto stick it? We do not. That's oh. another rank play. Oh, oh that, that is a fortune for on the feet. Oh, Gibbs. He would have get two. That's why I walk it. Really good play, you know, to walk close because you don't really expect the person to walk that close. <laughs> looking at the camp, hunting it down. It's low, bro. It's not that high. Oh, could they able to get another one? And they even it out. Do they check close right for Gibbs? They do not. They do not. It's good for a third. Doesn't expect the last one, so still a chance in the round for UH, but see two people here, including the op of flaws. Flaws winning a pretty interesting angle with the op. This is definitely a one and done. Yeah. This is definitely a one and done, like, hey, trade me out spot. But UH. Getting calm to just run on over to the seaside. And Defenders being okay with it because really they just need to group up, right? They don't give the opponents ones. All they have to do is group up and play trades on the retake and they'll win. Opting to plant safe. A little bit interesting because it does limit what they can do. Uh -huh. But that's okay. Don't look too connected unless. Ghost moves up quite a bit, yeah, as he is, but maybe he droned out. Yeah. Expecting this play. Lot blind and Ghost being chased down like a dog with that Odin. Booty able to get one, but traded by Airlock. It's gonna be a tenth round on the board for CS. Concentrate, Sova. You failed. A nice try from UH. I mean, really, I like the idea. It's unfortunate that in crypto TP is out in the open because when you TP heaven, I mean, you just got a couple options, right? You can TP out in the open so that it's you're faster to get the kill. You just hope nobody looks heaven, mm -hmm. or you can kind of hide. Honestly, where Gibbs was holding when I make that play is like, it's one of the hardest. Like that's one of the few spots they can play that will like counter most of the, like what UH is trying to do there. Mm -hmm. Pretty rough. Okay, we get back into it. We see a stinger by. Where's so how do you feel with the stinger? I hate it. My gun makes me so you sad. You hate it when it's used against you? Yeah, or you hate I can't it when... use it. Everyone's so oh. good with it, but I. Oh no! Oh, oh no! no. Oh, no. Oh, oh no! One con got con back sight. Oh, it's an op. Oh, oh the stinger chasing him down. Never mind, it's a vandal. Oh, Messi getting spammed. The oh. Odin just doing the work and AGO being invested in the round. Really unfortunate stuff. Odin so yucky. <laughs> UH appropriately taking a timeout. Odin is a great guy. If you can use it like that. Yeah. I mean, it's gross I mean, because it works. You're doing it right. It's gross because it works. Yeah. 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 Like people will hate it, but if you use it to... You know, it's full of fact. It's, it's not much you can do, uh -huh. except cry. Yeah. Crying is a really good option. Yeah. That was just so yucky. He got an ace from that. 
Got an ace from that. And one spam kill, three of them just lined up. Just can't make that up. Cannot make that up. But that's okay. We take those. Again. So going back to the stinger. I don't know. Whenever I play against a stinger, just three shots in my head. When I use a stinger, I don't know where the bullets are going, but they're not going three in the head. I'll tell they're you not that. going to the head. They're not going to the head. They're going everywhere else. <laughs> but maybe that's a me issue. I don't know. <laughs> I refuse to believe it's a me issue. It can't be that good for everyone else. Oh, uh, okay, okay, okay. We're coping. I like that. I yeah. like that. Coping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. I like that. I like this. It's okay. I, I can't use a stinger either. No. Thank you, Observer. Another good, another banger. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can see that you always putting a lot of emphasis on the middle of the map. It'd be messy having a late lurk. That's quite a few times, though, so I wonder if the team is going to be picking up on it. Oh, okay, on to great dark break. We're looking like aim labs out here. Oh, wow, really brave. Oh, did tag ghosts. Not able to complete the kill, though. It was too fast. Let's see, about to walk into the Cypher site. Crazy trips. This is going to be helped by Jun, though. Wow, that trip is actually insane. That is a crazy trip. That is a crazy trip. Do you see that are they getting smoked Cage off? Or... Oh. Oh. oh, but it don't matter. It oh. don't matter. Oh, but it does matter. Gibbs able to get one. Oh, it does, it does matter. matter. Gibbs able to get two. Spike down a. Crypto. Oh, about to be put down. Wow. I like the idea, but the defense just connecting the shots. Nice yeah, fortunate. This is going to be UH's last chance to keep it even a chance, a hope within two of two maps. Not going another round. So we have to see what they're cooking. Oh, this is a nice spot. That goes there. Yeah, Odin. Yes, this should do. Is in the hands of Drizzle, which is always dangerous. Looked a good first map, and I think once they started using the Odin on this map, it, I mean, they're already doing way. not bad, but the kills just went up exponentially. Aww. Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. And they're about to get aggressive. Oh. See if they can get jet. But looks like it didn't connect the knives. So it has to... Turn tail and run. And now is looking to be a linchpin in this play. As they look to actually hit A, it might have bit Gibbs, so they might know where he is. Oh, is he's here to help. Connects that first shot onto Messi. To the plant, and that's okay. On the nice, able to get one, but now the opponents know where he is, and it's always a hard game as an attacker. It's like, you know, do you move forward? Do you, well, what's the timing to actually backstab somebody? Oh, Crypto able to get one, moving up. On the great timing, Crypto with one bullet, really brave. Blinded. Now all of a sudden, you gotta kind of play together. And they just play time here. Molly is out. Nothing with fire. You talked. Able to peek out. Great timing on that peek. Land the headshot. You wait to stay alive for another round, Rosa. Yeah. I mean, good lurk with on the peak. Good yeah. Substantial yeah, pressure, you know. I mean, it's that whole thing we we're talking about earlier, right? Of getting aggressive but not too aggressive that you give up whatever advantage mm -hmm. you went into so yeah pretty good stuff big fan big fan revealing area Presence on the going in, but 
Stop by the trip. Jin able to get the kill and ending up his location. Momono being used to grab the bomb, but we got Drizzle. We got the Odin super close. Does he expect it? He doesn't. Oh, no. Don't really matter. As Messi's actually caught up with the ult. I actually don't think they knew where he was, but now it's it's bad. It's 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 bad. It's it's it might be Charlie. It's Charlie. It's going to be another round, getting 13 for CS. As we go to a map three, which I believe is Bind. Which Bind. Which can be a good or bad thing. Mar Marissa, what do you think about Bind? We talked about how we feel about Split, talked about Haven. I how do you mean, feel about Bind? It's all right. I don't know. I don't hate it. <laughs> There's nothing terrible about it. I don't really have any complaints or com like super interesting comments. It's just fine. Okay. You know, it's been in a rotation just, forever. Just okay. Yeah. That's fair. That's fair. Me, me personally. I mean, I also have lineups on that map. Oh god. Uh, so as you would, as you would expect, that's that's uh, near and dear to you your know, heart. It's it's one of my. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You know, it, it's one of those things where I just tell people like, look, you plant the bomb wherever. I have a lineup for it. <laughs> like I like I I made some like for an A site. For because you know everyone knows the lineup for default. Yeah. Right? Most grooms know the lineup for like default. Yeah. But they can plant anywhere on triple box, and I made one so that it'll like hit all of it at once. I have to throw one molly, and it'll hit behind, like in that little cubby of the box. It'll hit in front of the box. It's planted for short. It'll hit on the other side. It'll hit everything. That's what that, that's my baby. I'm really proud. Oh my god. Okay, I mean you don't gotta look that disgusted. You could look like happy. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this Your is, face this is just is, pure like. This is why I'm stuck in gold, bro. It's I need to I need to <laughs> no, start learning like lineups. <laughs> no, 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 definitely don't, definitely don't. It's, it's not good. It's not good. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's going to be really interesting to see. I mean, I think we can expect to see the Viper that we've seen uh, both times. Probably Messi on the Viper again. Uh, maybe see one on the side of CS. We'll see. Uh, it's going to be pretty interesting. I mean, you know, I, I feel like some comps vary so much, right? Like. I've seen some competitive teams. I mean, they're kind of an outlier, but it could be as extreme as like Paper X, right? You see a team like that, Cook. I think they have like a Brim and a Harbor or maybe a Viper and a Harbor. I'm not sure. Uh, I've seen some people run Harbor on like some other, like not VCT teams, and it's worked pretty good. So oh, we'll have to see. It could be uh, pretty interesting. I believe we're loading into the map uh, pretty soon. Uh, we're going to a break. I was just told by Prada that we're just going to a break. So I'm a liar. We'll see you folks in a little bit, and uh, we'll be back with Map 3, Bind.
All right, and we are back with Bime, the last map of this series. We're going to have to see who is going to go the distance. Yeah, I'm very excited. Noticing Messi's not on the Viper, though, after playing Viper all these maps. <laughs> that is true, but all good. We'll figure it out along the way. You see, I know for a yeah, little I'm pretty bit. surprised. <gasps> oh my goodness. There Tell he me is. not. Tell there me he is. not. There he Tell is. me not. Oh my god, I love him. <laughs> I mean. It's so interesting. I feel like Bind is the first map where the double controller thing started out, like in the collegiate scene, you know? They started adding the Viper in, and that's when Viper started getting added to all these maps. So for there not to be a single Viper in these two teams is like kind of kind of crazy to me. Sure, I mean it is it is a little it is a little surprising, but that is all good. I'm really interested to see this Gecko play. I honestly thought I honestly thought we might see the double duelist because I know for a little bit UHC was running a double duelist on bind. I don't know how long that lasted, maybe one game, but very interested to see this gecko. Yeah, I mean now we do see airlock on the duelist. So really I mean, really it's actually been very interesting to see the side of CS switch roles like every map. <laughs> like they are they are all just just doing everything. Mm. I remember Love seeing it. an interview by a pro and it was like, we're just going to have people play with their best out on every map instead of having people be on their roles. So maybe that's the meta. Just play what you're good at. I mean, yeah, I mean, really, I mean, comfort pick is the name of the game. Really, like people kind of underestimate 
like how good it really is, but it can make the w a world of difference. Like, you know, you're not even playing the same game. Let's see how this attack is cooking. Looking to be maybe a fast A short push. Already in. Ghost able to connect to one. Three getting a second. These all three attackers close to the A site. They're like, uh, kind of lurking out, seeing what can cook. Might be cleared out by Ghost. Didn't quite see him at first. Kind of an awkward fight, but Ghost does come out on top. So you just with two ghost. A short players left, yeah. One enemy remaining. Damn. Oh, on the peak. Good for the first. Not quite landing the second, but that's okay. We're still four up. and try to swing out it there's but ghost is gonna use the ghost perfectly <laughs> enough and get three in the round you can't really get to see too much play from the gecko i'm just so interested because I've, I've not seen a lot of gecko come out on this map in general so it's, it's gonna be very interesting to see what you know what the haps is on there right mm -hmm. there I just like his ability that he can plant the bomb. Like that's oh, little little wingman. Yeah, little wingman. I hate that thing so much. What? I hate I hate him with a passion. I'm sorry. I remember when he first came out. Everyone was like, "Don't kill wingman! Don't kill!" Him. I'm like, "Oh, I'm gonna shoot wingman!" Like I no have a little more. drawing of wingman like on my desk. I love him so much. I'm I'm I mean somebody has to. Be <laughs> See some action coming in. See that. Attackers are pushed up a short. Nice. Oh. One enemy remaining. Look at the See some gecko usage, yeah. See Encrypto cleaning up the anti-eco with four on the round. Getting ever close to Thrasher. Really strong ult. I don't think his name the is Thrasher. <laughs> no, the ult is Thrasher. It's Thrash, bro. Thrash is ready. Oh, right no. That's his name. Right You're right. I know. I love Gecko. It's okay. I, okay, I'm banned from playing Gecko, so it's not like I've ever, yeah. you know, been able to use the abilities. <laughs> Anytime I hover them, they're like, get back on smokes. I'm like, okay. Real. I'm on. I'm on. For, I'm like perma smoke prison, so it's yeah. I, I don't. I don't get the liberty of exploring. Okay, though. Don't like me, the attackers are gonna explore the side of the map. Someone's there. Gonna be a nice one for one trade, but. Weapon advantage, especially with that judge, is in favor of CS. And Crypto gonna try to play close. The judge. Oh, maybe, oh. maybe, definitely not. Definitely not even a choice. Not even a chance. Oh, you see? Oh, maybe. Maybe. Wow. Airlock is just unhittable. Soaring through the air. When you when you when somebody Quite jumps at you with the judge, you dare not even shoot. You dare not even breathe. Or it could be your last breath. Some flashes coming in. Good U2. Just to hold it. The ghost, really aggressive, really brave. Coming in from Ghost, and that's Messi left alone. Oh no. Let's see what we can cook. Airlock wants a fourth and oh. oh. Very easy. Messi, gonna put him down. See what they can do. Oh, Messi gets another one. Maybe he would have get the gun. Bring him to the next round. Not a bad consolidation prize. Two kills and a rifle on your bonus. Or three kills, excuse me. Not too, too bad. And let's see how UH plays it with a full array of guns at their disposal. Gosh, every time I see this skin, I've just I've just been like... It, it's, been, it's been growing on me more and more. I don't even play this game that much as, or as much anymore. And I, I feel the need to buy it. I know. I can't. I just bought the battle pass, which is ten dollars. The new skin came out. I just can't. Do I give in, Marissa? Do I give in? 
I, I want to encourage you not to, but like, it's so nice. It's so nice. And once it leaves the store, who knows how long it'll be, take to get back. Exactly. Oh, we're spinning a really aggressive trip. Oh, 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 no. Didn't able to get the kill, even though it was tripped. Oh, wow, could he? Kind of not sure where to look. He would have get the first, but not able to follow it up, putting the game to an even three and three. We see the attackers jump towards A, though. On the peak is still going to be here. Dizzy would be reclaimed. Let's see what on the peak can cook. He's able to cook one. This is going down. Nade to deny, but okay, Messi is there. Get up the second, and now airlock. Left alone. He can do. Oh. Repositioning. They're putting some pressure on the defense. Still needing to see what can get done. Crypto, maybe not as aware. Not ready. You get a flash, but Messi's good for the swing. Be three one in favor of UH. This is just kind of a funny story. One time I was in a, a hot topic and the Valorant song started playing. That one mm -hmm. it was crazy. I was I was that, with TJ actually. What did you <laughs> did, did you start head banging or something? You gotta Hell like yeah. represent. Yeah. No, <laughs> we looked at each other because we both recognized oh it. We're like, what is happening right now? I mean, can you imagine just two That's random scary. people just start headbanging Hot Topic? Honestly, maybe not the most off-brand thing to happen in there, but it's still yet. Yeah. You see... Not as great armor on this oh. side. Andre, doesn't matter if Jizzle's gonna hit shots like that. Might be on for a second. I'm gonna be putting a stop to it, but... Still I didn't know the about the two other players. Yeah, I mean, I don't think they were able to recover the gun, so... Attackers might be looking to snag that up on the peak. Aware that all four players are going to be coming. The peak would get one. Messi and Onda are holding it down. Make sure they don't get too aggressive. I say that, but Airlock evening it out with a one shot and a nice alt. The deal. I see what Cody can do as Ghost rotates in. Are aware of where both players are now. One enemy remaining. Ooh, last Airlock, nice one shot. Airlock with a second one. To secure the round. These ecos are just kind of insane. Yeah. Good 4K from Airlock to put another round for his team and forcing UH into an eco. You can see, I mean, Airlock's feeling it, right? Like he has money to upgrade, but. I have a feeling he might just stick with the Guardian. I mean, after you win a clutch like that, it's kind of like an ego thing. It's like, dude, who, do I need another gun? <laughs> Probably not. See, now it's on this turn to wield the judge. But he's gonna put some pressure. Really good baiting coming in from Encrypto. All they thought for their efforts was a Guardian and Drizzle. Nice TP timing, leaving Ghost alone. Not much you can do there with a Classic and a Bucky. See now, again, even both sides having guns. We gotta see what they're cooking up here. I locked aside it, all right. It's time to, time to upgrade. Get a different gun I can one-shot headshot them with. Hmm. How do you feel about people who say like having higher ping is like an advantage? I have never met somebody who's played on high ping. That is I agree with that. I've, I never. Understood I've never. That. You can like you can say that, but I've never seen somebody be like, "Oh yeah." Like then you ask them what ping they played on, they'd be like, hey, "40." It's tough. I'm just like, "That's that's crazy." <laughs> that 40 ping. Oh my god. I'm I'm sorry. What Have you tried 90? Have you tried 100 to Texas? I don't know. Nice trade. Oh, 
really good round. Nice triple from Cootie to seal that round. Okay, all good, all good. We keep going. Still, nice buys. A little bit weaker on the UH side. Nothing really need to worry about. See, a heavy A presence. We're looking at probably an explosion on a short. Well, maybe work some picks, but there are three defenders here for UH. Wade. Ult into U Haul. This is my pressure, but immediately changing the mind. I was like, all right, let's let 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 let's fake it out. Maybe reading that how many players were there. I don't know if they were counting U2. Oh, and again! Airlock was about to catch him out. Could he able to get two? Nice kills though. Oh on the peak. I had to go through the TP, I think, and trade it out. Maybe looking for the last player. Which is long, and do they TP? Jun is kind of in a precarious situation, but looking like might decide to go after all. I think they were counting the util. And actually, look! Wow, look at this! Look at this call! 30 seconds left. The defenders have no idea. The defenders have no idea. Only now, Kuri is... Oh, and even then. Oh. I mean, th this is okay, though. They're, they're grouping up. Kind of listening for you, till. So they probably hear this brimstone oh, go yeah. down and they'll all retake together. But once you give up a sight, players like this, I mean... 10 seconds left. No, it, 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 it goes from an advantage to so really no guarantee. Oh, they were betting on the thrash, so... Planted. Able to see where both are. Jen able to trade and now it goes into a 1v2. Ghost able to swing out right. As little man did did work. The little man was an intimidation factor. Yeah. Right? You, you, you saw. Yeah, you saw looking towards wingman, expecting player to swing out, but both went right. Really good micro play. And a fifth round on the board for UH, but you know, a little, a little, a little bit dicier than I would have liked. And we see another force. I mean, this really just seems like the game of like, all right, semi weak buys. You know, mm. we've seen only maybe a handful of rounds that really have been like, okay, rifles for rifles, but not as much as you would think. Because we do see a timeout coming in from CSUC. What, what, what have you seen, Marissa, so far that screams like, oh, yeah, that's working? Besides airlock with a judge. I honestly think the gecko, the gecko is putting in work. The util is just so overwhelming. Like there's the flash, mm -hmm. and then the molly you can't walk there. Then the wingman gotta shoot that, gotta look at that. And then the flash, you gotta shoot it, or you gotta, you can't turn away from it. Like it's just really overwhelming util, and I think crypto is using it really well. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. I, I mean, shooting the new dizzy, it feels like aim. Like I always kind of took my time. I was like, all right, I have like a second, you know, maybe like hold the angle in case of the swing, look up, shoot it, look back down. I was like, all right, but now it's like, you better, you better hit the grid shot shot on that like instantly, or, I mean, you're probably yeah, done. You're probably exactly. Done. Timeout is coming to a close. Head into the back half of our first half of our last map. But careful. See judges on both raises. Heavy shower presence. More than you would expect. Nice aggressive cams. I'll sniff things out. You see on the peak. On the little, little overzealous. But the judge, airlock, just going in though. Airlock does not care. They found my wire. Well, looking to go out even more. Planted. Oh, super, super blind, not able to see. I'm gonna get info. No one is bench, but Drizzle is good for the shot. Flaws is two. 1v2, but it is equalized. Oh. Messi good for a third, and now you can just smoke bomb and get on it. I don't know where Jin is. Jin is mauling the bomb. That is where Jin is. You know where he's at. Last player standing. And now, all of, all of a sudden, it gets way harder. Jun, great positioning. 
And I think Kuri did that fast enough to, to secure the round. I think so barely. as well. But that was a messy round. That was, that was... I mean, that, right? Like, like at one point, you're like, okay, you know, Onda has a judge in halls, probably holds down halls, he has to give it up, and airlock just comes out of nowhere. Looking like air support. Um, <laughs> and put in, put in a lot of work with that judge, so. Again, round in the end going to UH, but. Other ones are, they're pretty scrappy rounds, you know, they're, they're pretty yeah. dicey. I, I haven't seen a lot of rounds. Way. Yeah, even the series, I've it's not been not that many rounds where I'm like, oh yeah, like this team has the unlock. Smoke's down. See a heavy A presence coming in. You see yes, you see. I'm the trying to get control. They get really aggressive showers. Looking to hold it, but Drizzle is good oh. for that. Drizzle is good for both, actually. That is a site for free. This is having five health on the dream. Heavy shower retake coming in. You can just see, I mean, all the CS players are just so grouped up. So close. Like, what do you do? Airlock, with, still with the judge. Gonna get some chip damage in and very well does it to Kuti, the person who can't be healed. Jun in for the flank, but Kuti reads it actually. So aware. Now it's all about how much damage can you do? Little man defusing. Can't defend it. Drizzle's gonna get three in the round. Flaws cleans up the last kill. That's four on the board for CS yeah. to UC. I mean, again, with the cypher. The cypher that can shoot is a scary cypher. That is true. Isn't it, Work, isn't it crazy? Sorry, I didn't mean to throw it. Isn't it crazy? I just I was thinking of back that like back in time. But like now I feel like I see so many schools or so many players for collegiate who put their like school in their name. But back in yeah. the day, like nobody did that. Like back in the day, you were a weirdo if you did that. Yeah, I can see you being a weirdo if you do that. I think it's silly yeah, like, unless all of your team does it. Like you're a weirdo, but now it's like, oh yeah, like I belong to this school. It's like, oh now I know this school is like the real deal, you know? Like it's, it's crazy how different it is. So back to the action. You see a trade going in the way we was even, but now I know it got you. Oh, with Util out. Gibbs actually safe in that corner. Gotta check it and get the kill. But the attackers are on their way to A. Planting four back site, we see a really aggressive position. Position, excuse me, in from flaws. Hoping to catch some of the de these defenders off guard. A really good A swing off me contact player. See, nice play. Oh, almost, almost messy, but secures it. Yeah, you see flaws. You know, not proud. He's like, all right, yo, low, low key, yeah, get the skin out of my hands. Yeah, <laughs> once you whiff like that, it's like mentality is like, dude, I no. Like, yeah, switches to the Phantom. He just, he's had it up. <laughs> he's had it up. Laws can't be bothered. And you know what? I feel that. Maybe I'm biased, though, because I am a Phantom player, so. Yes, this should do. It's my chance. See more trips coming up. Oh, Ghost is, is my spot. looks to hold Let's the A site on this that last round there. of the half. These halves have been so even. Yeah, they've been really close. Uh oh. See, airlock going in. I haven't found encrypted yet. Hey, hey, but he would have. Oh, do they know about the other player? Oh my gosh! Crypto landed on Drizzle, putting UH in the advantage. Not sure if anyone's close right to go past. Crypto to land the shot on Gibbs. Oh, on the. What he's doing with his. Oh! Almost whiffed. Not... They don't look aware that he could be short. And he does have a molly. Huge fan of Jun. Huge fan. The molly lineups. Oh. Getting super low though. And on they able to finish the kill. I I think that's I I think they would I think they still win it. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard to tell. Yeah. And that's all good. Gonna secure the round. But those lineups, I mean lineups, you know, this it's People discredit it, but again, Switching huge sides. fan, and they can win rounds like that. Mm. 
right? Like he gets, if Jin gets a kill on Onda, all of a sudden that's is like super winnable. Like I'd argue like Jin probably wins that. Yeah, I think so too. Like, I don't know. Cause you have to stick the line up or you can't hold the line up and then you have to fight and then- Yeah, I mean, you, you could do the super meta thing where you like look at the lineup and try to block it and bounce it off your own body. But anyway, I've never yeah, seen someone successfully do that yet. I've, I've I've done it once. I've done it once on this map. You probably felt like the shit after that, huh? I I, I felt I th I thought I was him. I thought I was him. I went online. Did it win us the game? I don't think so. But like for that one <laughs> round, I thought I was him. You see the second half. Early info gathered from Belong to a huge presence. You see at least two players from the Sky Dog. And a really cheeky cam. I mean, that's so hard to break. You have to like full commit in, and it, it, it's so hard to gather the courage to full go in, right? Mm -hmm. You don't know what's waiting for you in a hookah. Really good cam. We see Flaws playing a really patient game. I don't know if Ghost checks this corner. Looks like he might, but here, oh, Ghost might have been seen his. Oh yeah, Ghost definitely saw this. Yeah. Launching smoke. Good kill on the Flaws. I did like the idea though, but. Long barrel gave him away. Jun has a classic in U-Haul. Always a... Maybe, maybe hit it with a couple right clicks. Oh, Honda. A little bit more slippery. Honda getting another kill. And now it's on to the last two players. Oh. Airlock getting two! One enemy remaining. And for the third. Honda able to clean it up, but... Airlock, you know, the dream maker. My goat. Honda with four on the round. Looked a little bit dicey, but good awareness from Ghost and you know, just to slowly, slowly walk up seeing Flaws Barrel. Really, honestly, just kind of unfortunate timing because you saw Flaws had a pretty good idea what to do, right? You know, that jiggle. Mm -hmm. um, that jiggle gave Flaws even a chance to win because if he doesn't jiggle at all, I mean, Flaws is just dead for free. So, kind of an unfortunate timing to take there. Yeah. The call is just to kind of play back, see what damage you can do. Everyone's kind of playing a corner. And what should do? We have a marshal active on flaws and showers. Nothing. Probably gonna peak here. I mean, usually you don't want to die in extrem on an extremity of the map when you have the economy advantage. Mm -hmm. But it looks like goats might disregard that. Might just peek in. Flaws might have seen him. Very from the angle. And now Ghost is aware. Ghost cages oh. up and Anna is behind Jun. The airlock is also there to secure. Drizzle is able to take the TP and push Ghost, get rid of him. Crypto backsight. Trying to get Hicks to equalize the game, but before the rest of CSUC comes in with more kills. That thing is landing for Messi. Some shots are, but not before Gibbs. One to the dome with the classic. No armor. Just a surprise to win the eco round. But really good plays. I really like the crunch onto Ghost in showers. It was a good play for Flaws to stay alive and Drizzle to recognize, like, all right, hey, yo, I'm going to push this guy. Like, let, let, let's fight this and get that kill. So really, really good. Again, some of the micro team plays. It's such a different spectrum watching collegiate gameplay. Like it's its own world. Cause it's not, not you as. You mean that in a good way as, or a bad yes, way? Yes, I mean it in a good way. Like okay. it's not as coordinated as pros, of course, but like it's so interesting right to here. like see what everyone's picking up. You know? Yeah, I mean some people cook up like insane things. I remember again. I keep saying the back in the good old days but when I was playing. I mean, shout out to SGSU. My brothers, but they would run breach on every map and go hyper aggressive. Yeah, it was really bad. They were, they they ran breach on icebox. Oh, that would make me so yeah. sad. It was it was really bad. It was really bad. Spike planted. Do you see the offense going aggro on elbow? Be prepared for it. On the night we will connect the kill, but Jenny able to connect both heads. 
Airlock. I think I saw Messi. Yeah, in the smoke. Oh, one left. Go oh, seeing what he can do with the classic. Right click. Not much. It's airlock. Things are pretty clean around, all things considered, for the defense. Yeah, some people, some people cook up some demonic things in Collegiate. Yeah, there was a breach on every single map, including Icebox. They did aggro, a a whole bunch. It was, it was, it was tough. It was yeah. Tough. Again, shout no, out, shout tough. out to my boys. But I hate to play against you. <laughs> <Yes>. I, <laughs> they, they were the best. They were the best in the West for region. For reason. Oh, no, they were, they were. Spot. They were our representatives at the Red Bull. You're one for a reason. And then Northwood came in. I did Northwood things. Okay, so Flaws taking a first pick onto Messi in the showers. Not fancying the second fight, opting to probably go for a heal. Might just find the rest of the attackers. I got the spike. In his destination, but. Spike dropped. Not to B, as the attackers are cheating over towards A. See Ghost playing so patient outside of these showers. I mean, they're aware of his positioning. Somebody had to light up flaws. Let's see the Cypher come back around. He's walking over. They are spotted from a short. Flash to deny, but doubled up inside of U-Haul. They're just holding it down. It does not matter. Ghost trying to activate the cage. Let's see, what does he do there? Kind of a whole lot of nothing as he's cleaned up. Mm. Unfortunate looks. Unfortunate looks coming in from that side. This might be an obvious thing, but like. I feel like it comes down to winning your ones, and I don't know if UH is doing that in this moment. No hate to them. Yeah, I mean, Flaws is doing great damage, or at least holding them off in showers. Mm -hmm. Constantly there. You can see they smoked it off this round. Try to get aggressive. Ghost looks aware. The timing is bad. Not gonna expect push out. Out of the map, you have another attacker that goes down. Uh -oh. All of a sudden, oh, let's say Flaws has another pick, but Cootie is aware. Cootie just seems to know when to turn around. Yeah, he's got big eyes fan, in the big back fan. Of his head. Yeah. Eyes in the back of the head. Oh, oh no, Stim Beacon down. Um, he's attempted. Messi, good for one kill. Goody, good picks, but where we touted him for being, you know, aware of when to turn around, but going to be aware enough that both players are on left. his flank. Looks like he might know about the hookah player. Did see him. No. Both players for CS can converge. You see the head. That's the dink. It's super low, but I mean, look at the ults from USC. I mean, they could they could secure the run if they wanted to. Bonds himself. Nice kill. And now they know who the last player is. Oh, oh but Jun, so fast on the flash turn. Able to connect the headshot onto Kuti. Put any dreams of the winning the round to a halt. A screeching halt. I mean, still, Kuti is so aware just to be able to, like, figure all that out. I mean, absolutely. Absolutely. Another timeout coming out from UHE. Yeah. Looks like they, I mean, UH had a lot of good ideas, but it looks like they've almost hit a wall. Mm. Right? They're not sure where to where to go from here. And I, I mean, I don't blame them. You know, what like, what do what do you do? Right? It just it just seems like 
showers is unlock i mean kuka is like not hard to take but getting out you know it just isn't the most fun thing to do in the world mm-hmm. we are cooking a little bit little unfortunate but that is okay because the side of cs i mean they've been doing so many things right you know like just playing as a team it, 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 they they have looked really good mm-hmm Right there. Right there. We gotta see what UH has hooked up in this timeout. Oh, that is a crazy trip. This goes here. <laughs> oh, this is a nice spot. Uh oh. Operator. Oh. Shot not hitting, but now they know that now they know it exists. Now they know to be aware. Could he looking good? that first pick and you don't know that there's only one defender there playing retake with an odin drizzles back at it again with the odin cage triggered oh, in a real dangerous game i mean i'm sure they're not aware of it how can they be but it is it is there it is ever present it's lurking marissa it's lurking ready to pounce at any given moment Oh. Jun able to get it. Oh, get there. Airlock too. Oh, Airlock with the oh, getting lots of space. Safe way to plant this bomb. Could he able to get in the cubby, but messy up for the old kill, and that is another round going for CS. That op getting last kill. And this this defense by CS just looks so strong. They are it is just an impenetrable defense. Mm -hmm. Absolutely love to see it. They don't over rotate, and when they do, they have at least one anchor. So they're playing this about. Yeah, as I mean the rot can. yeah the rotations for this team have just been on point. Shot missing. Oh, getting some good usage, but Jun, you timing the flash, or maybe just tanking it. We get two. Those peeking in, airlock. For the frag, though, instant headshot. And Jun wants to make sure they keep that space. We have isolated both of the UH players in here. Both stingers. <laughs> Look at them. They're <laughs> sure that moment of, hey, I don't know about this. I'm pretty sure the attackers are aware that they're they're just both in here. If they really wanted to be mean, they could just be molten. If they really <laughs> wanted to be That would be pretty mean. Mail the that would be pretty mean. Hilarious. Hilarious. Mean. Yes. Blinded. Yeah, uh -oh. and 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 they, and they and they just know. I mean, they don't even have to do anything, One right? Remaining. Uh oh. They're gonna Spike UH is gonna try. A. Flaws is just gonna be there for the kill and Goody just has to try to do a little wide sweep. Before he oh. gets run down, yeah. Gibbs is just jumping in. Insult to injury with the classic right click. Free gun, by the way. Best gun in the game. Best gun in the game. Anyone who says anything different? Cap. I do think the Frenzy has its moments where it is the best gun in the game. But that is my humble opinion. That's fair, that's fair. Look at these trips. These trips are disgusting. Like, you know they're meant to be used with the, uh, they're meant to be used with the Odin. Like, like, like you, like you, you just know what he's going for already. <laughs> so close. No, no, no. You gotta respect it. You gotta respect it. That's, not everyone can use the Odin, Marissa. It's, it's it actually, it, it it's takes a skill. A little bit. Yeah. It's a skill. It's, the people can be like, it's a Gaki Gamba. It's, it's. You know, not everyone can do it. Yes, you're right. I know. It's 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 it's, it's, it's like me with the judge. You know, because it takes a lot of skill to use that. Yeah. Like move your mouse. Lots of skill. That's hard. That's hard. If you have to move your mouse, that's hard. Right. Good though. You can see that UH seems to be waiting for 
Yes, you see to just make a mistake. But I mean, again, the discipline on the side of the defense is just so strong. They they don't want to over aggress. They know that hey, they've been coming to our site and we've been winning. We don't got to do anything crazy. We don't got to do anything different. It's really forcing UH's hand. Thirty seconds There's left. A very aggressive corner. And just look at all the control. I'm starting to get over towards B, but I mean, you can see, I mean, with timing like this, I mean, look, they don't even, oh, I mean, good for the trade. But Gibbs still retiming on left. the util. Okay. On the peak. Good for that, but I don't even, yeah, they, they lose the time. Oh, Kuri could have won that. Not able to land the other kill. Match point. Law is able to turn. I mean, and for an opera eye, that's, you know, that you can't do that every day, right? My ult's not ready. Like, sometimes when you get shot from the side, you freak out, but Law is able to keep their composure, connect the kill, and make sure they get a 12th on the board. And this is dire straits for UH. I mean, pistol round one, but that was off of a big 4K coming in from Onda. Not much happening else from the UH side. This is how the last game went. That is true. The one team just seems to run away with it in the second half. It goes first. Which not out of it yet though. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh. I really thought they were going to line up. Flaws, great internal timing. Fortunate for Encrypto, but now the IGL can call strats from the dead. But a little harder to do that when Ghost and Onda go down. Two players left. Knives come out. Let's see what Kuri and Messi can cook up. Oh, see Flaw's kind of freaking out. Almost knowing, like, hey, we won. And and saw the injury, right? Just going up. That is going to be the last map bind and the series going to the side of CSUC. And honestly, well played Valorant from them. Right? Yeah. They, again, we 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 stopped, we touted it from map one. They look disciplined. They hit the shots. Uh, both players uh, or some players from both teams like really showed up. But in the end, I mean, I, I think just CSUC was looked so strong as a team, so yeah, super disciplined, they looked and really I good. really can't much you can do with it. So uh, I don't not really familiar with how the C Val is going if it's groups or if it's like a bracket system. But uh, going forward, I mean, good luck to both teams if they are continuing to play. But, um, I'm you know I'm glad to that I got to see some pretty good Valorant. Marissa, you got any closing thoughts? Um. Wait, man. <laughs> <laughs> wait, man. Wait, that, that, that's yeah, the only man, thought. Head, head empty. Yeah, I'm head only empty, thinking about Gecko. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, either way, thank you for your wingman thought. Uh, thank you, everyone else, for joining us on the stream, uh, for watching this game between UHE and CSUC. We hope to see you again for future broadcasts. Uh, good luck to both teams with the rest of their seasons, and have a good one. We'll see you folks later. Bye.